the Milwaukee Bucks. 4-3 on the season. They've got a big game against the Oklahoma City Thunder in this episode. So I want to give a huge shout out to these couple of subscribers right here. Ericus Wade, Anthony Huff, and Jose Burgos. Thank you guys for suggesting the Thunder, but let's get it. So as you guys saw in the intro, we are taking on the Oklahoma City Thunder in this episode. Now Larry Sanders is still out with injury. One to two weeks, we should be getting him back within the next few games. Now, as you guys saw in the, not the last episode, but two episodes ago, I was shopping around Carlos Delfino and Jared Bayless, and you guys voted for me to trade these two players in return for J.R. Smith. Now, I think this is a decent trade, thanks to the few subs who, there were, I didn't add everyone who suggested J.R. Smith, but thank you guys to, who did suggest them, so I'm going to try to go ahead and um, trade for J.R. Smith, I feel like he'll be a good asset on this team. He's a shooter, he's a player who can uh, score the ball whenever he has the ball, he's a good playmaker, let's put it like that. So with that being said, we are going to offer Jared Bayless to call stuff in return for Clean Anthony early and J.R. Smith, not going to accept it, and then look at this. He drops the hammer on us. We offer him a second round pick and he decides he doesn't want to talk to this organization anymore. So the second most asked for player was Gerald Henderson. Has the same overall as J.R. Smith and I feel like Gerald Henderson will fit with this team very well. Uh, he is a sh he's kind of a decent shooter and he's a player who fits the scheme of the Milwaukee Bucks pretty well. So we end up trading for Gerald Henderson in this one. Trading Carlos Delfino, a second round pick and um jared bayless in return for gerald henderson so with that being said we are taking on the oklahoma city thunder in this one it should be a great game but before we get into that i'm gonna go ahead and level up my my gm level get that up to a level 10 now if you guys don't know what this is you can leveling up your uh, your gm level allows you to reach different points in this in my gm which i think is pretty cool so before we get into our first game, I'm just going to go into the gym, shoot around with Joe Henderson, get used to his release. Now, I want to thank you guys for all the support. Make sure you guys smash the like button if you haven't already. But without further ado, let's get into this game. We honor our nation's heroes on this Veterans Day and welcome you to NBA on 2K Sports. Ernie Johnson along with Shaquille O'Neal. Our matchup tonight taking place in Milwaukee, the BMO Harris Bradley Center, as we watch the Bucks go up against the Oklahoma City Thunder. Last game for the Thunder, they picked up the W against the Kings. Feeling confident after a runaway win. We'll see if they carry over some of that momentum. Shaq, the Bucks took Jabari Parker with the number two pick. How do you assess what he brings to the NBA? Well, Parker, not yet. I and mean, he's not a great defender, but he can do it all on offense. Parker is an NBA-ready product. He's ready to go. Can't wait to see this kid play. One sensational year at Duke and now with the Bucks. That'll do it. Both teams ready for tip. Let's go to Kevin Harlan. So I am back and... We are taking on the Thunder in this game. Should be an awesome game. We are wearing our alternate unis in this one. At least the Milwaukee Bucks are. The Thunder did not decide to partake in this uh, fun event. So, it's all good though. Doesn't quite matter. Now, here in the opening tip-off, we got Jared Sollinger and Kendrick Perkins. Now, as you know, Larry Sanders still out with injury. So, can't really have him down in the center position. And right here, we find OJ Mayo. Foot's on the line, but it's all good, knocking down the two-point jump shot right there. So, I didn't show it in this video, but Russell Westbrook is actually out with a broken foot, and that sucks for the Thunder, man. They're losing their starting point guard, so Reggie Jackson really has to step up in this one. As you see, Jabari Parker knocking down the three right there. Now, I wanted to talk about some real-life NBA. I mean, I commentate NBA 2K as Brandon Knight knocks down the three, but... Did you guys see Julius Randle? I mean, he broke his leg yesterday. Now, I got the notification on Bleacher Report saying when it first had happened, saying that Julius Randle has a slight leg injury. That's what it said. And then I looked more further into it on Twitter. It turns out he had a broken leg. Now, I wasn't actually watching the game because I was uh, doing my homework and I was editing up some videos. So I wasn't watching the game. But I, I mean, I feel, I feel for Julius Randle. 
I, I've never broken a bone before, but I he's going to be out for the entire season, and that is just rough on a player, especially a rookie, man. Especially a rookie who has a lot of potential in this league. But, you know, we're all praying for uh, for Julius Randle, and I hope he can make a smooth recovery. As you see Gerald Henderson making his first baskets in his Milwaukee Bucks uniform. First basket as a buck. Now, Brandon Knight beasting through Serge Ibaka right there, getting the layup to go. The and one play right there. Now, Knight once again dishing it off to John Henson. Let's take a closer look at that one. As you guys can see, Brandon Knight with a no-look pass with a left hand. Finding John Henson with a two-hand jam right there. Now we get OJ Mayo knocking down the three. OJ is a beast for us. Now a few guys were telling me that I should go and trade OJ Mayo. But I'm not quite sure about that. I mean, OJ Mayo was a great player. But as we are heading into halftime, I'm going to send it down to Doris Burke and the reigning MVP at the sidelines. Well, Kevin, obviously a very close game. What has been your approach tonight? Well, we're just trying to pack the paint. Those guys are great. So we're just trying to make them feel a few guys, get some deflections, and get some of my easy baskets. Kevin, thank you so much. A hard-working Kevin Durant, gentlemen. Okay, so I haven't really talked about the game much, but let's get right into it. Zach Levine missing the lap right there, but we got Jared Sollinger with the no-look two-hand jam behind the... What is that? Like, reverse slam, I guess? Now Zach Levine taking the ball up with the going in. The team is hyped, the players are hyped, man, even I'm a little hyped right there. But Zach Levine gets a little too excited, missing the dunk right there. Now Reggie Jackson on the other side is going to get blocked by Jabari. Jabari kicking the ball up to OJ Mayo, or excuse me, I meant Zach Levine right there. I don't know how I mixed them up, but anyways, Zach Levine has the ball. Calls for the pick from Sollinger. Sollinger sets a strong pick. Now he finds OJ Mayo. Buckets in the corner. Three ball gets it to go. Now Gerald Henderson. First three as a Milwaukee Buck right there. Hopefully first of many. I'm a low-key big fan of Gerald Henderson. I don't know. I just really like the way he plays. I, I mean, he is my bald... What the heck? I didn't even say... I said beast. Man, these editors don't know what they're doing. But anyways, Brandon, I, as you guys see that dish from earlier in the game, finding John Henson under the basket. Now right here, Serge Ibaka. I don't know how he made that shot. If you guys were wondering, I am playing on the on Superstar Difficulty with Simulation Sliders. Now, Gerald Henderson knocking down the shot. Now, this game isn't too far from reach. We've had a lead once in this game, and that's when OJ Mayo hit that first shot in the game. But, you know, 50-52 right here. This game is still in reach. Now, four-point game. Jared Sullinger getting the dunk over Kendrick Perkins right there. Taking another look at that one. Nice play by Jared Sullinger. So, this game is only two-point game right now. We still got a lot of time to make a comeback. Now, Sonder, or excuse me, Parker finds Henderson. Henderson finds Henson. Henson tonight should have been a foul right there, but it doesn't matter. Tying this game at 56. The crowd is hyped. I mean, last year, the Milwaukee Bucks finished 15 and 67. And so far, with already four wins on the season, I mean, I think we're definitely going to get more than 15 wins. But right here, Dwight Parker's going to get the tough foul. Shaking up a little bit on the play right there, but it's all good. He's going to go to the line, make one of two free throws, making this a one-point game. Now, Brandon Knight gets the wolf steal right there, finding Jabari. Jabari's going to slam the ball. Now, it's Serge Ibaka at the free throw line. 59-58. He's going to end up making the first free throw. 59-59. It's anyone's game at this point with a little bit under a minute left in this game. Second free throw is good as well. Serge Ibaka, one of the best shooting power forwards in this league. Now, we've got Brandon Knight right here. Brandon Knight has the ball. And you know when, Brand when the ball's in Brandon Knight's hand, something good's going to end up happening. Brandon Knight gets the ball back from Jabari, knocking down the three, giving us the biggest lead of the night with a two-point lead, believe it or not. But it's now tied again at 62. Giannis, big three, got it to go, making it a four-point game. Let's go, Giannis Atentacunpo. That is a huge three for us. Giving us the lead. I don't know why I said four point, but it's actually a three point lead. Now, they need to get a quick three, but you know it's NBA 2K. 
the AI isn't that smart. Instead of Reddy Jackson shooting the three, he tries to kick it down low. We get the steal, and that is going to send Brandon Knight, one of the best free throw shooters in the league, to the free throw line, ultimately making both free throws right here, making it a five-point game. Now, Reddy Jackson has to hit a three, finds Lamb. Jeremy Lamb's going to end up hitting the three, but you know, you can hear the music in the background. We've won this game. Too little, too late. The newbie Gerald Henderson knocking down the free throws on the play right there. What a game, man. We, I mean, the Oklahoma City Thunder, one of the premier teams in the league. Now, in their defense, they didn't have Russell Westbrook, but we still walk out of this game with the W. So that's going to wrap it up for me in this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys smash the like button if you did. The more likes we get, the more videos I will upload. Hope you guys have been enjoying the daily uploads. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'm out. The greatest of all time If I had all timers I would sound like y'all rhymers Y'all would say anything In order to get paid But I'm trying to make a G2 Like Gatorade But I don't do it for the ends I do it because it's in Me, it's all love And I do it